Hey guys, it's Tiny Tom Logan back with a video that an immense amount of you have uh, all been looking out for, looking forward to, all that kind of stuff. Yes, before you ask, I do feel a little bit like Flavor Flav, but hey, come on, if we can't take the mickey out of ourselves, who the bloody hell can we take the mickey out of? It's just a gigabyte lanyard, and I think the uh, Noctua fan <laughs> gives the Flavor Flav style a little bit of nerd chic. Anyway, it's down to business. <clears throat> the uh, competition should have been a Christmas 2010 competition, uh, but because of the weather and all the snow and stuff, it's kind of rolled into 2011. So we're going to call it the Snow White because of the Three White Rigs 2011 competition instead. Now, many of you will be aware, but for those that don't, we have three main prizes that we're going to be giving away. And they're all fully built, uh, overclocked, ready to rock and roll gaming systems. Uh, the uh, third prize rig in a Fractal R3, thanks to Fractal and uh, also Quiet PC, they really, really did uh, come up trumps for us with this competition. So a massive thank you to Paul and the team at Quiet PC. Oh, amazing. Anyway. In the Fractal R3, we have a Gigabyte P55 UD4, we have a ICE 5 760, which is uh, running at 4 gigahertz, 200 times 20 overclock, with uh, some custom made, massive thank you to Mushkin, they made us some custom made white RAM. There's 4 gigabyte of RAM in there, but it's 1600 megahertz, and it's at 686 24 timing, so tight, fast, lovely, proper, amazing. And then thank you to HIS for the uh, 6870 graphics card that's in there. Uh, Kingston supplied a 64 gigabyte V plus 100 solid state drive, and then NZXT stumped up a 650 watt Hale 90 white power supply. If you want to see the videos of the specific gaming rigs, because I've done loads of these videos already showing the build and all the parts and benches of all these systems, just go and take a look at the channel, because uh, literally everything's there if you want to do research about these rigs. So that's the third prize rig, or the bronze rig, whatever you want to call it, and then we swiftly move on to the second place system. This again is in a Fractal R3, which God... You know, at the end of the day, uh, Quiet PC sent me this on the 23rd of December because we got let down because of the weather in Europe and stuff like that. And they got me this on Christmas Eve. They were absolute lifesavers. Lifesavers. Literally, if they hadn't have sent that rig, this competition would have just been, it would have been dead in the water. So that's one of the reasons why I keep mentioning them. So if any of you are looking uh, to upgrade a rig and you need heat sinks, you know what I mean, uh, Pretty much just go and have a look at the Quiet PC shop. They've uh, got state shops, um, uh, US shops rather, and they've got uh, UK shops as well. So just go and give them a look. If for no other reason than for me. Um, right, uh, in here we have a uh, Gigabyte X58 UD3R V2. There's an i7 950 at uh, 4.2 GHz. For it's 200 times 21. There's six gigabyte again of the uh, Mushkin White Ridgeback RAM. There's a HIS uh, 6950 graphics card. There is a uh, Kingston V plus 100 128 gigabyte solid state drive. A 850 watt uh, NZXT Hale 90 power supply. You may think that's a bit overkill, but at the end of the day this rig is ripe and ready to chuck another HIS graphics card into. All cooled by a Noctua NHD14. Uh, it's all overclocked, stable, ready, lovely, doesn't get hot, completely silent, just literally ready to rock and rumble. You can stick your favourite games on this and it's, just, it's not going to... You're going to be checking to make sure it's on. Uh, and not being funny, it's going to pretty much run every game maxed out. You're not going to get a problem with these rigs at all. And because I've set them up, I've also saved you overclock profiles in all the rigs as well. So, should you uh, want to run it at stock or anything like that, you can flip between. So yeah, it's all in there saved ready. Uh, so that's the silver, um, or second place rig. Moving swiftly on to the first place rig. This is a monstrous 
and I do mean monstrous rig, anyone in their right mind would be overjoyed to have this on their desk. Uh, the case is an NZXT Phantom um, and we've changed the front and the rear fan for Noctua's. Uh, it's got a Noctua LHD14 uh, cooler in there because as I've stated many times before, the Noctua stuff, as far as I'm concerned, is the stuff that you need to be buying. Um, now, motherboard, the thing that's going to be holding all those lovely parts together is a Gigabyte uh, UD7. The uh, processor is an i7-970, which I've been quietly surprised that a lot of you haven't realised that that's a, a hex core processor. So yeah, 6 native cores, 12 threads. Um, that's been overclocked to 200 times 21, so it's also running a 4.2 GHz overclock, but it's not getting hot, it's, ju it's so just sat there, happy as Larry, it's just unbelievable. This, it, it is completely silent, you've got the uh, fan controllers on the case, so you can adjust it as you want, but even with it in completely silent mode, this process is not hitting 70 degrees. Now, we have a HIS. Uh, 6970 graphics card in there with a uh, NZXT Hale 90 1000 watt power supply again ready just to chuck a second graphics card in there in crossfire if you do want to upgrade in a few three six months time however you see fit um, but with this rig it's got a 256 gigabyte Kingston V plus uh, 100 solid state drive, so an absolutely monstrous drive in there for you as well. Uh, you pretty much could chuck a storage drive in there to uh, keep all your movies and photos and stuff like that on, and you could have all your games on the solid state drive as well. So, this rig is absolutely, I mean, even I l love this rig, I run a 970, they're immense. So for me to be able to give uh, prizes like these three away to you guys really does make, do you know what I mean, make my, my job and all the effort I put in worth doing. And I'm so looking forward to you um, giving me feedback and letting me know how you're getting on with these rigs for the three lucky winners. Now there are three main prizes. Obviously we've got the three rigs, but we've also got a selection of runner-up prizes as well, which my beautiful assistant, Mr. Strawberry, has got placed on his lap at the moment, and he's going to start handing them to me now. We've got a pair of NZXT uh, Hale 90 550 watt power supplies. Then we've also got some an NZXT Sentry, uh, and this is the external fan controller that you can uh, have on your desk and it's all touch screen. And then we've also got an internal fan controller which goes in your uh, optical base, takes up two optical base. And then we've also got a uh, graphics chiller from Coolink and a notebook chiller from Coolink. Now, the runner-up prizes, we quite literally are just going to randomly pick people and it could be along the course of the competition and we're just going to go, you can have this or we might do it at the end. We're literally, we're going to leave it open. Um, excuse me. It might be someone that's um, uh, having fun on the forums, having a laugh on the forums in the competition thread. It might be someone that I'm, uh, I've taken a liking to on YouTube. It literally, for the runner-up prizes, there is no set rules. We're just gonna we're just gonna rock with those and then hand them out to the people that we think deserve them. But you all want to know how you can win the main rigs. Well, literally, what I'm going to do is put a link underneath this video, which will take you to Overclock 3D, and then quite literally, all you have to do is input your contact details uh, and pretty much because I, I, we've got to get specific contact details what we want to do is we have to be able to contact you afterwards but also just to clarify it's just so that the uh, supporters of the competition might send you one email and also uh, what we will do is once you've signed up you'll then be signed up for the Overclock 3D newsletter so that's it uh, if you do choose to uh, go and take a look on the forums and everything as well Overclock 3D please do there's an awesome group of members there, and to be quite honest with you, they are like family. They do, um, they, if you've got any problems, 
I, not being funny, my, my life is getting so immensely busy at the moment, I can't reply to every friend like I used to. Uh, but to be quite honest with you, the Overclock 3D family, they're all there to help. So if you do need any help and assistance with your overclocks, your rig, you've got problems, just go to the forums. And also, that's where we will be announcing the final winner as well. It will go in the thread Overclock 3D, um, so you're going to need to check there to see whether you've won. So, uh, I just want to uh, wrap up by saying a big thank you to all the supporters. Uh, we're going to start with Quiet PC because, as I uh, stated before, they did uh, dig us out of a deep hole. So, a massive thank you to Paul and the team at Quiet PC. We'd also like to say thank you to Coolink uh, for the fans and the cooling in the third place rig. Uh, as ever, Noctua. Uh, I could not do a competition uh, with rigs like this and not get Noctua involved because otherwise I'd look like a bit of a hypocrite because I do still think that their NHD14 is the cooler to have, my opinion. Uh, then I've also got to thank Gigabyte because uh, they've supplied the motherboards for uh, all of the systems. Massive, massive thank you to Intel. Again, processors for all the systems. Uh, 760, 950 and a 970. They really didn't skimp. They could have just given us cheap processes if they want, but they didn't. So a massive thank you to Intel there. Uh, also a massive thank you to HIS for supplying all of the graphics cards. Big debt of gratitude to Kingston for all of the solid state drives. Again, they let us stick with the tears, so big, big thank you to Kingston. Also, we need to say a big thank you to NZXT for all of the power supplies and the Phantom. Uh, at the end, and pretty much, uh, I think that's about everyone. Have I forgotten anyone? You haven't been listening, have you? I don't think I've forgotten anyone. Uh, oh yes, I have forgotten someone. I said thank you to um, Quiet PC for sending us the Fractal, but we also need to thank Fractal themselves because although um, Quiet PC have sent them to us, they've actually been paid for and authorised by Fractal directly. So, there you go guys, we have three Overclock 3D branded uh, white systems, and I can't believe this, but I'll keep going past my light and it gets dark. Um, I have forgotten to say a big thank you to Mushkin. Now I need to uh, clarify the position with Mushkin. The reason why these rigs are white is because of Mushkin. They literally custom made us some white Ridgeback heat sinks. Now these are not available to buy. Um, they've done them especially for me and this competition. Now all the guys at Mushkin, so uh, Wade specifically, they're amazing, but also their tech guy, Steve, who is just phenomenal. Uh, I'd like to say a big heartfelt thank you to both of you guys as well for making this possible. And I hope that these prizes are worthy of your super sexy white ram. So, without uh, rabbling on too much, because looking at the uh, clock on my camera, I've already been talking to you for 13 minutes. I would like to wish every single one of you the very best of luck with the competition. If you are outside of the UK, you can still enter. This is a worldwide competition. But if you are outside of mainland UK, uh, you are going to have to pay the shipping on the rigs yourself and just arrange for it to be collected uh, from me. But, so, well, at the end of the day, if you're not comfortable with doing that, then please don't enter. Because uh, if, you're, if you don't want to pay for the shipping, we will pick somebody else. So, yeah, it's worldwide, and that goes for all of the other prizes as well. Any one that we... Uh, pick and choose, if you're outside the UK you just got to pay for the shipping. So, there's no uh, UK only, nothing like that. And uh, we will also, I may pick uh, some extra people to get some of the, I may send you some, uh, uh, a knock to a medallion or something like that, because we've got quite a lot of uh, Gigabyte branded stuff. Uh, hopefully going to be getting some more t-shirt stuff like that. So, there's going to be uh, extras going into the cases and there could be some extras going out to you lot as well. Now, I'm getting a dry mouth, I really need a cup of tea, and uh, Mr Strawberry has uh, had his feet curled up on the sofa for a long time, I think he wants to go and play with um, some hardware. So I'm going to have to sign off, I wish every single one of you the very best of luck, 
and uh, the closing date for the competition is Valentine's Day, Monday the 14th of uh, February. That is when we're going to close the competition and we will announce the uh, winners shortly afterwards. So let's see how many people in the comments underneath YouTube don't watch the video to the end and we'll all give them a slap afterwards. But for now at least this is Tiny Tom Logan with his biggest competition ever out.